you've probably clicked on this video because you want to learn how to do an abstract art piece for your living room. I'm here to show you how to achieve that look. I pre-mixed up some paint and I'm going with some sort of earth tony colours so it's going to be quite a contemporary piece not really sort of in your face it's going to be quite a subtle piece no idea what that's doing there so we're going to be going down on a 25 inch by 36 inch i believe canvas this canvas isn't actually stretched and there's a good reason for that because if you do your painting and you don't like it then you haven't wasted a whole canvas you've just wasted a sheet of canvas so that is quite key but I'm going to show you today how to create your own one for your living room and it's going to be quick and easy to get that desired contemporary abstract painting look. If you're new to this channel please subscribe, hit that bell notification. I release a video every single Wednesday called Wednesday's Works on Flowworks and you can get to learn how to create some abstract art for your living space for your house for your office anything so follow along to this one and we'll get cracking we are timeless. We are timeless. step number one we're going to create a background wash to the actual piece and that's going to be consisting of uh, some gray and some white i'm going to chuck some gloss medium into that mix a little bit of water massive massive brush and we're just looking to cover the canvas to start with. Skies are moving, I'm standing still In the shadows of your twilight Step one complete, it was boring, but we got the background, we got the base down. Step two, we're now going to start to apply the colour on top of the background colour and then start to create our abstract piece. So this is where it starts to come alive. Gonna actually try using some sponges as well this time, so we'll see how this effect comes out. We've loaded up some colour on the sponge, then we're just gonna come up with our design. Every season, every change, you'll be the sunlight, I feel I'm a fade. going light to apply these marks. Just trying to get that colour on there. Got some light dark grey here, so we're going to go in with this. And I Step two complete, now that you've had some fun with step two, I've got some metallic silver. I'm gonna uh, try and get that in some areas on this painting. So this will sort of give you some highlights. Let's get this in there. This is etched into eternity. Every moment, every breath 
that is it. I'm going to end this one here. I do actually like that last light streak panel that I added in there. Absolutely love this contrast of colours and the blues and the, and the dark greys and the whites and the, and the actual silvers sitting over the top of that. So yeah, I think your eye sort of draws into this piece. That wasn't difficult. You can do this one at home. Once that's stretched on a canvas and on your wall, that will look really good in your room. Please subscribe for more art like this. Hit that bell notification to be reminded of when I release a video every Wednesday at 8 p.m. UK time. And please give this one a thumbs up if you like this painting. I'd appreciate that and leave a comment down below what you think of this as well. So thanks for watching. I'll see you next week in Flowworks. I promise you I'm all in, no turning back. And every day, every moment, and every breath you take. I choose you